Well, hey guys, what's going on? Just got out of the shower. I wanna show you guys some stuff that we've done around the house here. Why well, I haven't uploaded anything recently. Give you a quick update on what's going on around here. Well, the first thing is this. Yeah, Crystal wanted a raised garden. So, I built this whole, this crazy conglomeration out of a bunch of pallets. <laughs> you can obviously see that. Try to put some plastic over the top of this thing, some clear plastic. I don't know how long that's gonna last, but so I've got a little place where she can either sit down or I can sit down or whatever, where we can put tools there or, you know, put the pots and stuff like that that we're growing. We decided that we're not gonna line it with any type of felt or anything like that and then put dirt in it and then have stuff grow that way. I think we're just gonna keep it all in individual pots and stuff. Now, this cart right here is kind of pretty much done I gotta mess around with the uh, foot pedals a little bit but other than that then it's done something else that's kind of neat is uh, I made the hi Kelly some plants growing see how I made these little pot these uh, holders I took um, oh this is one of those you know it's almond milk containers and I cut it in half and flipped it upside down and opened up took the lid off so we have the bottom right here with the carton turned upside down so that way when water goes in it'll come out the lid and collect in the bottom so the water so the soil always stays nice and fresh with a lot of uh, water in it and this plant right here wow this thing's just a champ I don't even know what this is but yeah just yesterday this poor thing was all brown and crusty looking and well, now it's coming back to life but all these um, little containers right here all these are apple trees we're getting apple trees to grow and I might uh, if they get big enough I want to go plant them out into the yard we have this bush that we bought yesterday and I don't know what it is dwarf burning bush oh that's what it is yeah once it's once it gets big enough, all the all these leaves start to turn red. That's kind of neat. Then we have this up here, and this is mint. That's mint. So we're gonna let that grow a little bit. And the reason that I have them all sitting here is because uh, it's kind of out of the sunlight, direct sunlight, so they don't burn. But uh, also. At nighttime, all the condensation that collects on this roof drips off and falls right into the plants. And that's, I think, they're, they're, they're just freaking out. They're just growing really, really good, all these apple trees. Now, something else that we did, Crystal's U-joints on the front end of her, her Jeep are, went, went, uh, went to crap, so... I had to tear off both front wheels, replace the UV joints, and then uh, put the whole thing back together. And I didn't film any of that because I was getting really mad. <laughs> that was a job all within itself because everything was crusted together. Everything. I had to use a hammer to bust everything apart. Now I'll come down here to where our garden is at. Now we've got all this rhubarb growing right here. And we decided to plastic everything and put rocks down because this area was just getting really bad and weeded. I have all my onions already going to seed. And we have a little compost pile here too. And that looks like that's doing pretty decently. Now we have these tents set up because we're planning on going camping one of these weekends. I don't really know which one, but we're gonna go out and get away out and get out of the house for a while which I don't see why we have to because we got all this yard we could just camp out out here but I guess that's just not the same what are you doing tipsy kitty kitty yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> now something else I'm working on here and for the shop is a uh, wall mounted camera holder I'll be putting that video up on my T-Man's Builds channel. Yeah, and the, and the uh, Wastelander is still kind of on hold, you guys. 
Got to do all this stuff around the house first. You have something else, my other camera. The camera that I've had, my Canon camera that I've had for I don't know how many years. Took crap on me. So right now I'm using my my phone. But after I showed Crystal that there was uh, that the Canon is all broke, that it just wasn't working. The power wasn't staying on or, you know, it just was not working. So she ended up, she let me have her camera. This is a um, E05 Canon. That's what this is. So now I'm going to have this big bulky thing. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> yeah. And she's had this for four or five years now, something like that. Barely uses it, so. But it only does uh, 1080p, 30 frames a second. That's the highest that it goes. It doesn't do any of the 4K. It doesn't do any uh, 1920 by 1080. It doesn't do any of that. And I tried to hook this thing up to work as a uh, webcam, but that didn't, that, that wasn't working. I don't know how I can do that. It's got USB and HDMI, but I don't know if I can actually hook it up to the computer to run as a to run it as a webcam. But this is probably this is going to become maybe the new shop camera instead of my other Canon, my point and shoot. But that point and shoot was so nice because it was so light. This thing, man, just these lenses on this is just like ugh. another thing I heard about was that I guess Tanacon was a flop and a half. Of course, then I've got my GoPro camera there with my external light. I use that quite a bit. I don't know if I ever showed you guys this, but uh, you know, this is my camera mount that I built. And then I can put my GoPro on there, and then I've got this projector light on the bottom of the thing. High and low, and then it's got flash, but that flash is about dumb. Well, what are you doing? <laughs> you exploring? Don't be camera shy. Tipsy. Meow. Kitty. All right, guys, so I'm going to jump on out of here. I just want to do this quick update, let you guys know what's going on around the house here, why I haven't done, why I've been so vacant on any of the platforms and stuff. I've got things to do around here. Then, yet yeah, today we got to go out and mow the front yard and the side of the house. But, anyways, post down in the uh, comment section. How many projects are you working on right now? And I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs> Wait, actually, I'll probably see you guys in the live stream. See you later.